This is how you can use an A10 to completely automatically generate videos with the new Clink 3.5 Turbo model. This model costs 35 cents per 5 seconds of video and this is a pretty insane video model. It's topping the ranks, it's better than actual VO3 and here you can see the actual response from a very simple example. We're going to be using Fall AI for this model as an API provider and I'm going to give you the A10 workflow completely for free on the link down below in the description. You're going to find it there, you put your email on Gumroad website and you get a JSON file which you can import on your own NA10 instance. If you don't have an NA10 account, you can create one through the link in the description that says NA10. They give you, if I remember correctly, 14 days of free trial to test out the product. But in general, their fees are very cheap. And on my channel, I also have a local installation like the one I've got here, for which you can use completely for free hosted on your computer using Docker. So search my channel for that. You are going to find it if you don't want to pay anything. But let's get started seeing this workflow. We're going to create a realistic POV of a policeman. We're going to be using the Kling. 2.5 turbo model. We're going to use MM Audio version 2 just to add a little bit of sound and everything is going to be automated end-to-end -end using my workflow 9A10. Now, in order to enable this workflow and be able to use it, you will have to create a new workflow 9A10, click on the three dots, import from file, and you import the file that I gave you just right now through the Gumroad link. It's that simple. And by the way, if you want to learn more about NA10 and automations, I've got a course on Udemy. I will put it also in the description down below. You can buy that and get about four hours tutorials on NA10 and I will be updating it every single month. But let's get started. Let's see the exact steps and what is happening. It's very, very simple, guys. All of the nodes are preset. They have been made for general availability. Of course, you can change instead of getting the prompt from a chat message, you can get it from a file or an NA10 data table. And of course, you can save the video URL, the final video with the audio to, uh, for example, an external website or use an API provider to upload it. But this is outside the scope of today's video. The scope of today's video is to give you this workflow and show you what you can create with it. So let me show you what I have created in my first test example to just to make sure that the workflow is working. So let's give it a try. So as you can see, we generate five seconds of video. We see the policeman car behind, we're in the desert, we can see the man walking. So I'm just going to change this a little bit. The response is nice, very high quality. I've seen a small error here with the text. This is probably due to safety policies, but it's fine. I'm going to change my prompt into a realistic POV and hopefully this will make the video better. We are going to generate it end to end. And the only thing you gotta do on this workflow is just click on the first node and set your credentials. So the idea is very simple. You go here, header auth, you have to put authorization here, and then you have to write key. It's very important that everything is case sensitive. So you want authorization to be with capital A. And here you want to do exactly this. Let me show you. Key, space, and your file key that you are going to get from file AI. And you will also have to get some credits into file AI. The minimum deposit is $10. But of course you can, you know, if you don't like the response you see from today's video, you can just not use it. But I think this is a very powerful workflow. This model is very, very powerful. And if you see the benchmarks for text video leaderboard, the Kling 2.5 Turbo is in the top spot. I would say it's matching VO3, again, without audio. And it's one of the top models out here. And the same exact happens for image to video. In this workflow, you are going to have the text to video generation, but you can of course change it pretty easily by just specifying the turbo image to video model and you input a prompt and an image, which could potentially give you even better result than just going from text to video. But for the case of demonstration and giving you the whole workflow, this is pretty simple. So I'm going to give it this prompt here, realistic POV of a policeman, okay? 
that's what I'm going to do. First, I'm going to clear execution, click play, and it starts to generate everything. One of the negative things is that the generation of the video takes about three minutes. So my first wait trigger here takes a lot of time. All of the other ones are very simple. You get the video URL when everything is done. You put it into the audio. So the MM audio generates the audio and it gives us on this node the final file. It's very, very simple. You have to change nothing. You can just add nodes at the end or at the start. And maybe you want to use a different kind of audio generator or maybe you want to just remove this. Again, totally fine. You just use this get URL as your final output. So if we go here on clean text video inside file.ai on requests, we're going to see that our request is indeed okay and it is in progress. So this is very important. When you first set everything up, try to run the workflow and see if it has any mistakes you can check it by checking the requests under each model. You can see here the requests for MM Audio as well, just to verify that File AI takes the correct input and everything is okay. So it's very, very simple also to do debugging, meaning solve any issues. And again, I have tested this workflow in great extent and I think you are going to find no issues. Just in any case, if you have any issues with the workflow, if you weren't you know able to create it and use it just let me know down below in the comments whatever you have and i will try to help as much as possible so in order to not waste any more of your time i'm going to pause the video till this whole workflow is done it's going to take about five minutes of my time so we are going back here in just a second for you guys okay so we're very near the response what i really like about this workflow is that if the response is not ready, the wait flag begins again. So it has a loop here till you get the final response. The MM audio also takes about 22 seconds. So if you don't want to wait more, you can just change this wait flag. So we finally got the final response from both models and it is this link over here. Again, as I've told you, you can save it anywhere else you want. You just place it on your browser or use a wget request and you get this file. Just for demonstration purposes, I'm going to watch it through file.ai. So let's watch the video. This is from Kling, and this is the final video that was generated from MM Audio. Let's see it. Okay, so the man is walking towards the car and the generation is very, very nice. I see nothing strange. Of course, you can listen to the audio. It's not very perfect. It's a little bit off. So I would highly suggest that you either use a different kind of audio generation model or just put your own sounds if you want to. Um, the only reason that I'm using this MM audio is because it's super, super cheap. It's like 0.001 cents per second. So it's pretty, pretty cheap in all honesty. So that's the main reason I'm using it. But there are also other video to video generators that you can use. So it has like sound on the back end. Now I don't know if all of these are able to bring you exactly what you want. So just make sure to check the specifications of each model. So this is what the workflow. I think in all honesty, Kling 2.5 is very powerful. And this is just one request. There could be other requests that are actually a lot better. So make sure to play around with it, prompt it a little bit, spend a little money to start getting the exact prompts you want. But in terms of realistic results, this is very, very powerful. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next video.